Go. Hey guys, how you doing? This is Rich from Rich TV Live with a very, very special opportunity to see a landmark in the world, Chichen Itza. One of the largest pyramids in the world. Over 1.4 million tourists come and see Chichen Itza every year. And we are here today for my very first time. I couldn't be more excited. Welcome to Chichen Itza. Very special place here this is where they used to play a sport where they would try to keep the ball in the air and then get it through those little hoops and this was like modern this is like ancient gladiator days where these athletes would play and the winning team would survive and the losing team would actually die so they played to the death Amazing, amazing history here, beautiful architecture. You can see the size of this field, it's just enormous. Bigger than a soccer field, I would say. But the punishment for the losing team was death. So, kind of like modern day gladiators, but instead of fighting, playing sport, where the winning team survives and the losing team uh, loses their life. So, uh, pretty interesting place. Kind of being on this field is very interesting because you can almost feel the energy of all the people that have played here. And you can see it's uh, just an enormous field, just absolutely enormous. Breathtaking. Oh, there's sculptures over there. These are the sculptures of the winners and the losers. The losers have the biggest sacrifice, which is beheading. And the winners celebrate their victory. This is the sculptures in the stones that have been here for hundreds of years. There's a sound here that is made which sounds like a bird, specifically in this location here in Chichen Itza. Would you like to play here? No. No? Of course, yeah. More inscriptions telling the story of the winners and the losers of the game. So much detail in the stone. The 
the stones tell the story. And then wherever you go, you see these serpent heads. The detail, the serpent head of the stone. Must remind you, these have been done for hundreds and hundreds of years. Or sculptures. Sculptures in stone. Inscriptions in stone. Over here, I'm going to show you guys what it is. Yeah, like this. And if you look for the skin, you want to find it. All of these skin is the snakes growing up. This is where the Mayans used to come on this platform and you can see these structures and the scriptures. There's so much detail in these stones, it's unreal and it's everywhere. It's a little wooden thing. Hey guys, this is one of my favorite places uh, with Chichen Itza. You can see here all the temples. They say there's a thousand temples here and this was a landing spot for UFOs. Now nobody knows because this was hundreds of years ago what exactly happened here but it looks like there's a whole city here. So it looks like this was a place where lots of different things were happening. I don't know exactly what, but it seems as though there was lots of rituals here, a lot of different events. Obviously, we showed you guys the sporting event area. It was a massive field, and you can see the pyramids. You can see all the sculptures, and there's so many sculptures that have, and stones that have stories in them here. It's, it's unreal. We could be here almost for weeks trying to uncover everything. There's so much to look at, but I'm gonna do my best to show you guys as much as possible. Take a look.
writing. So the Mayans are well known for all of this, and they're also known for the Mayan calendar, which is detailed the amount of days in the year, the amount of weeks in the year, and a lot of these, a lot of the, the sculptures, a lot of the stairs, a lot of the design takes into account the days and the weeks of the year, and there's a lot of that in everything that we see here. So it's incredible that they created this hundreds of years ago, but they were so advanced when it came to architecture. It's a beautiful, beautiful architecture. Wow. These temples are just breathtaking. You can see panthers in these sculptures, in the stone. You can literally see panthers. These stones tell a story. Last time I was here, this wasn't here. And then it was that wall. You can see the inner markings of everything. Wow, it's enormous. can see the detail in these stones. Yes. The serpents. And it looks like little, like almost like monks. On top of those serpents? The Mayans. Those are Mayans. It's the Mayan settlements. Ancient Mayan settlements. Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small Way back before we blew it all Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small Way back before we blew it all Too many things going on I can't keep track of them all From people dropping a bomb To people putting up walls I feel like life is on haul Perception stuck in a vault I know that time can heal all But how much time till we fall? It's awfully chilly outside When there's no shelter to hide When everything is a lie You'll find that out in some time But when the things on your mind Are all considered a crime Communication aside We'll all just fight till we die Is this an argument? Or just the start of it? Either way I I don't wanna be a part of it Can I just get some space? I don't have the heart for this I can't be picking up the pieces Fixing scars from this Is this an argument? Or just the start of it? I wanna drive away So I can be so far from it I wanna find a place Where no one breaks their promises Or maybe drown myself In something that is bottomless Take me back to a place Where I felt at home Take me back to a day When we weren't alone Take me back to an age When the world felt small Way back before we blew it all Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small 
Way back Let's go. Me through it all I know that things seem bad But they could be much worse There's always someone else Who has a greater curse A greater thirst A hunger, pain, and mercy Just find whatever you got And try to be thankful first I wanna feel again I need a couple friends I never really understood Just how the story ends But I could feel it's tense Don't know the consequence The volatility of life My only confidence Is this an argument? Or just the start of it? Either way I I don't wanna be a part of it Can I just get some space? I don't have the heart for this I can't be picking up the pieces Fixing scars from this Is this an argument? Or just the start of it? I wanna drive away So I can be so far from it I wanna find a place Where no one breaks their promises Or maybe drown myself In something that is bottomless Take me back to a place Where I felt at home Take me back to a day When we weren't alone Take me back to an age When the world felt small Way back before we blew it all Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small Way back before we blew it all